dose, vapes. Keep your coils tight. Keep your wicks wet. If you're looking for new flavors, I'm all up on the clouds, bro. Filling up a clear road, we're dripping on the sub. Well, hello there, everybody. Welcome back to Overdose Vapes. My name is Travis, and I'm going to be your guide. I'm going to be your Sherpa through this uh, this mountainous climb of e-juice reviews that we're about to do. That didn't really make very much sense, but hey, I'm trying. This is off the cuff. You know what I'm saying? We don't write scripts for this shit. It's a fucking e-juice review. So what are we doing? What are we looking at? We're looking at something that was sent to us free of charge for this review. I had, I, you know, I really didn't know very much about the company, uh, but when I got the package, I was really impressed with the presentation, and I and I was really impressed with the, the flavor profiles. I, I was interested. Let's just put it like that. I was very interested. So um, this is coming. This is a, a product of Righteous Awakened Elixirs. It's uh, the Indulgence line, and this one, this particular uh, liquid is called. Crave, C R A V E, like you know, I'm, I'm craving a good juice. So uh, the recipe notes it, it says that it is a layered strawberry custard cake with custard filling, a sweet cream frosting, and strawberry drizzle. Now I'm going to tell you right off the bat uh, when I crack this bottle because it comes in 60s hashtag 60 mil standard. Great. When I crack the bottle, it does have that strawberry cake. You know, like like if you buy a, a strawberry cake mix and, you know, like an actual cake is strawberry, it, it has that vibe to it. It smells a lot like that. So um, to me, in my mind, I'm thinking they're using uh, several different types of strawberry flavoring, like some maybe some red touch, um, some, some ripe, some sweet. It, you know, all you DIY people, you know what I'm talking about. Uh, why don't we go up close? Okay, so what else? Is, <laughs> I'm getting ahead of myself because I'm really excited to try the juice. Because if you guys know me, this is totally my flavor profile. Cakes and strawberries and creams. That is my fucking jam. So I'm excited to try it. But um, let's get into what actually comes in the box. And then we'll go up close and check it out. So the box comes with this really nice like wax seal in the front, which I thought was super classy. But besides the, um, the 60 mil bottle that you get, you also get three bonus samples in the little, you know, the little lube bottles. You know, these little lube bottles? You know what I'm talking about. Um, so you get three other samples of their of their lines. Um, one of them came in six, one of them came in three, one came, one came in zero. I really like that, actually, because it allows me to try a six and to let you know if it's heavy or, you know, or what kind of six it is. And a zero, you know, I'm less excited about that, but whatever. People vape zero, you know, vape zero, so... But uh, the, the little samples that it came with are um, Rapture. There's a Key Lime Bavarian Cream Cheesecake with Sweet Graham Cracker Crust. Amazing. I mean, these flavor profiles sound amazing. Well thought out and decadent and fucking delicious. Temptation is a blueberry fritter cake with a warm blueberry filling and light sugar glaze and a blueberry cinnamon crumble topping. It's like they're going overboard. It's like, it's like they think, okay, we got a good flavor base. Now, you know... Turn it up to 11. You know what I'm saying? Like, like, let's go even harder. And I think that we really need that shit in the vape game. So, and then there's Seduction. It's a blood a blood orange bunt cake with a creamy blood orange frosting and salty caramel drizzle. Uh, drizzle. Uh, only problem I have with that is that I've had some very, very subpar, um, almost funky blood orange vapes before. So, But I'm not going to judge them too soon. I'm, gonna, I'm definitely going to give them a shot. We're not going to be looking at these three today. Um, I'm going to do separate reviews for all three of these um, little lube bottles. Uh, they'll be a little quickies, you know what I mean? Because you can't really do an up-close shot of a fucking lube bottle. But today we're going to be taking a look at this Crave. We're going to do an in-depth review of it. And, um, yeah, I'm excited. I'm really excited. So why don't we go up close? You can check out this 60 uh, mil bottle plus the box and plus the little lubes. And then we can get to vaping. The mist like communication cut like get lost. Pressed him for big heads like Rick Ross. All about the Benjamin. Teeth grip on state. Elevated top floor demeanor. I don't even need the roar of accelerator. I pledge it then separate them later. Cheapest creepers is my untied knots. Like my cleanest sneakers, why not? 
Rock the nice loose fit, I'm tight on my music, abusing my writing tools until the end choose to quit. Thinking like phonetic, algebraic, computing with a solution is replacing me with all that fucking putrid shit. But if I went down that road and I don't come back, you know the reaper keeping me on drum tracks. On point like thumbtacks, aggressive sentences like my lines, they punch back, yo, walk, I want that. Yeah, great, man. I'm fucking, I'm stoked. So once again, just to reiterate, this is a layered strawberry custard cake with custard filling and a sweet cream frosting with a strawberry drizzle. I have it on the um, on my Manhattan V2 with the battle deck, um, uh, the two-post battle deck with a pair of uh, Fuse Claptons, four-wrap, um, two-millimeter ID Fuse Claptons with cotton bacon, of course. You know me, cotton bacon all the way. So let's go ahead and give it another little drippy drip. And let's see what the fuck it's made out of. So the first taste I get is definitely the strawberry. It's like it's like it's like very um very rich with strawberry from in the on the inhale. It's like you almost only taste strawberry, right? But then about halfway through that as you're inhaling it uh, the cake kicks in, the cake kicks in big time, and it's that strawberry cake. It's not, it's not vanilla cake with strawberry drizzle. It is a, it is a straight up strawberry cake, and uh, it's like strawberry layered on strawberry. And I do get that custard, but it's not, it's not dark. It's not eggy. It's not heavy. It's more of a compliment to the cake, and it's more of a compliment to the strawberry. It kind of, it kind of brings out the, the, the essence of those flavors. Yeah, let me take another toke here. Great lung fill, very cloudy. This is in seventy thirty. It um damn near vapes like an eighty though. It's it's got a real real nice fucking vapor production to it. Uh, I'm I'm actually really enjoying the vapor. It's fun to vape. So um, what what was the other ones? I think I think it said cream cheese frosting, right, or something like that. Um, a sweet cream frosting. You know, it's coming across more of just creamy. It's kind of like um, there's like this definite, definite um, uh, strawberry. Not, not. I was gonna say sharp, but it's not sharp. But it's definitely pronounced strawberry. It definitely, it, you know, it, it it's 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 there. It's. I was gonna. It's hard to explain. It's not like uh, glimpsing it from a distance. You can definitely see the shape of the strawberry flavor. You know what I mean? Not visually, of course, but but uh, the taste of it is there. There's definitely it definitely has a structure. The the strawberry has a structure. It's not it's not masked. It's not uh, it's not muddled. It is definitely there. But at the same time, it's creamy. Uh, there's cream throughout the whole thing. It, the whole vape is creamy, and that cake kind of comes through at the last second and. Um, and, and, and like announces itself like, hey, hey, motherfuckers, I'm still here. And all the flavors have, um, you know, are present. And that's what I really like about it. It's not getting muddled. It's not getting like smashed together. They all have their little place. You know, they're, they're all very well developed. And, and I like that. And I think that's what makes this vape special. And I do think this vape is special. You know, it's. It's not your average run-of-the-mill strawberry. It's stacked on stacked on stacked strawberry, but it does it in a way that doesn't uh, make it's it's not over you know it's not overpowering, it's not sickening, it's it's not it's not too much right. It's just like these balances are just hit perfectly, man. It's hard to explain. Um, this is a really complex juice. It really is. This this is gonna be good. Um, for your more advanced vapors who want some nuance, right? Because there's a ton of nuance in this vape. While at the same time, I think it could satisfy even your brand new vapor because it does have that robust flavor and it definitely does have a strawberry that's present and that, and that uh, even, somebody, even somebody who's just quit smoking whose taste buds aren't fully developed again, they could definitely pick out the strawberry. I mean, it's, it's there. It's... It's, it is what it is. It's not hiding. It is a strawberry. So um, I think this is a good vape for everybody from your fucking novice to your hobbyist. 
uh, and everyone in between, I think this is going to shine in tanks, and I think it's going to shine especially in a dripper. And uh, I, to me, that's probably what it was made for because you're getting all those nuances when you're using an RDA. i got to take another tote. It's so fucking funny, man, because that strawberry cake... It's like you, you almost think every time you almost think, oh, is it is it not going to be there? Is it not going to be there? But then, boom, strawberry cake. It's fucking amazing. I don't know how they do it, but it's like uh, it's like each each flavor like is like timed or something. You know what I mean? It's like, OK, you got that fucking you got that two seconds of strawberry and now kicks in the cake and it's going to give you that two seconds of cake. And then here comes the cream. You know, it's like. It's it's like layered in a way that's that's damn near perfect, and and it seems like it's done purposefully. I don't know how the hell they could do that, you know what I mean? Um, but it, that's how it's coming across. Like it's purposefully layered, so that you get these flavors in the order they want you to. Uh, I'm very impressed. I don't know how much more I could gush about it. I'm very fucking impressed. For me, definitely uh, Crave is a winner. I'm going to give it a 4.8. I think this is a fucking top-notch juice. Would I buy this myself? Absolutely. Am I going to buy this myself? Absolutely. This is a top-tier strawberry vape. And if you're like me and you want a little bit of texture with your fucking vapes, and, you know, texture, cream, and strawberry, those are the three things that I fucking desire in a vape. This nails all of them. So, yep, 4.8. Um, I think you should pick it up. If you're a strawberry fan, it's a must buy. And um, yeah, fucking big time. So I want to thank you. Uh, I want to thank uh, the, the Righteous, I'm sorry, Righteous Awakened Elixirs for sending it out. Um, this indulgence line uh, has my interest peaked. Crave is definitely a win. And uh, I can't wait to uh, dig into these little, um, these little samples they sent as well. The little lube bottles. I'm really excited. All right, thank you guys so much for joining me, and please keep your goddamn coils tight, son. Peace out. I got to take one more. Even the smell is good. Fuck, it's terrific. Terrific. All right, peace out.